exactly. All right, Kate's here with a look at the rain. <laughs> it's really storms that are coming in tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow's going to feel like a spring day mm. when we get those nasty lines mm -hmm. of thunderstorms and heavy rain and temperatures in the 60s. Definitely going to feel more like spring than January. We got to 62 today. Today felt fantastic. It was not that sunny clouds around, but it was nice and warm. Mother Nature may be an Eagles fan, letting us kind of revel in some nice warm weather. But now it's coming to an end and here comes some rain. Let's start off though with the time lapse video. We'll start off with today and you can see the Delaware River, those big ice chunks really starting to melt quickly thanks to this nice mild stretch we've had over the past several days. And we had some sunshine peek through the clouds here and there, but on balance, it was a mostly cloudy day and clouds are still hanging around as showers start to push into central Pennsylvania. This likely not going to get here until early tomorrow morning, but it's going to be a quick hitting and intense system that delivers some pretty steady rainfall and also the threat for a few gusty thunderstorms along this front. So here's the actual cold front right here blowing up with thunderstorms over portions of central Ohio right now. Back to the west, this storm has been producing heavy snow all day up around Minnesota, Minneapolis and Vikings fans stranded here in Philadelphia can't get home because of the snow up to a foot there. One of their biggest storms of the year and now snow breaking out over Wisconsin. But for us, we're on the warm side of this storm and it's just too warm for any frozen precipitation. So even up in the Poconos, we're talking about rain temperatures right now. 52 degrees. That's more than 10 degrees above what our high should be this time of the year. It's 44 degrees in Wilmington. So timing this out, got some showers moving in by about 4 a.m. But the steadiest of the rain starts to come in around 7 just in time for the morning commute. And we're talking heavy downpours. Look at all this embedded yellow and orange. That's an indication of where the heaviest rain is falling. Here's 10 a.m. And right around Philadelphia, this line comes through between 10 and noon with the threat for some very strong gusty thunderstorms. Damaging winds are a possibility as well as intense downpours by 2 o'clock. That's mainly off the coast and we may even be dealing with some sun glare delays for the afternoon commute. So a big change after that. Scattered showers develop after 2 a.m. Widespread heavy showers between 6 and 10 and between 10 and 2 is when that heavy rain comes through with those gusty thunderstorms. Checking out our main models here anywhere between half an inch to an inch of rain is likely across the area and your morning commute will be the most impacted with reduced visibility ponding on the roads and the threat for sporadic gusty winds when that front comes through. So the first half of tomorrow looks pretty rough at this time tomorrow. It'll pretty pretty much be over. It'll be quiet turning colder though a 20 degree drop in temperature from Tuesday to Wednesday. Thursday's cold again and then Wait for it. Temperatures start to climb again. <laughs> By the weekend, we're back to the 50s, so another mild weekend on tap. Wait.